we have a bionic dolphin. Imagine a machine that looks like a dolphin, only the front flippers look more like uh, penguin wings, for example. And uh, it runs across the surface like a hydrofoil, dives underwater like a submarine, and leaps out of the water like a dolphin. The vehicle is driven by a 175 horsepower V6 sport jet powerhead, which has been converted and modified to fit the engine compartment of the vehicle. It's a real showstopper. Little kids run up and kiss it on the mouth. It's a strange feeling going underwater and not getting wet. My name's Don Badia and the type of car I have is a, a Dunton Mariner. It's an amphibious vehicle that's uh, manufactured by Dunton Marine and it's um, powered by a Ford Festiva drivetrain in which uh, all the parts from the Ford Festiva car are transferred over into the Dunton Mariner hull. So it uses the dashboard and the seats and the four-cylinder engine. As I'll be driving the car and entering the water, I'll switch and I'll have to shut the engine down and engage the hydraulic pump, which engages the hydraulic jet pump, which propels the vehicle in the water. And then I'll just roll into the water from there and off you go. It's just a totally different feeling than what you normally feel. You know, you're not used to the norm of driving a vehicle down a boat ramp into the water. It feels normal now. I wanted to buy a boat, and I've always wanted an airplane, too. I own the boat named the Cosmic Muffin that was made from Howard Hughes's airplane in 1964. It became an abandoned derelict when a hurricane ended its flying days, and it was going to be destroyed as scrap. Took it off the property, cut the wings and tail off, took the fuselage to a marina, found a boat hull, and then proceeded to convert the airplane into a boat. The interior of the boat right now is uh, half airplane and half boat. This is the original bar. We have the uh, headliner on the walls that used to be on here as an airplane. We have teak and holly flooring that's a very nautical touch. The original aircraft chairs are still here and the bar is still original. I've been living aboard the plane boat for 17 years now. Do we have clearance, Clarence? We got clearance, Clarence. What's our vector, Victor? We adapted the original controls that were used to fly the airplane to drive the boat. So now the steering wheels that are in the cockpit turn the outboard motors, and the throttle controls on the center console are now used for the boat motors. When we drive this boat, we always get notice from people cruising by and people on, on the docks or on, on land. They all stop whatever they're doing. They usually wave, get thumbs up. We're impossible to ignore and uh, impossible to forget. We devised a setup of removable side view mirrors so that we can see what is around the boat while we're underway. I thoroughly recommend living aboard a boat. It's, it's an entirely pleasurable experience. Nobody is as nuts as I am to make one out of an airplane but uh, living aboard a boat is the best. My name is Dave Drimmer, and you're watching Over the Edge TV.